Or if I found out my man had a friend like me, uh uh. Gotta go. One of us gotta go. Who's leaving? <laughs> so. It's giving wifey, yeah. It's giving somebody that I need right now. So come and give me life, yeah. Cause it's giving. what's up guys welcome back to miss wamagata my name is esther and this is my husband yes i'm her husband <laughs> thank this you this is my husband Jay. thank you guys uh welcome back to miss wamagata uh guys we know we've been missing in action and we're back and we're better and we're gonna be consistent right babe yes yes that's what we're gonna do so help us lord <laughs> Anyway, so uh, it's been a it's been a minute. It's been a minute. Do you want to update them? Should we update them? What has happened? Because it's been almost what two months. A lot has happened. A lot has happened. Okay, do you want to update them? Just update them. Just update them. Okay. I'm, I'm the guest. Uh, okay. you're not the guest at this point. So no, not anyway. Yeah, you're not, you're not a guest. It's a YouTube channel, so. You're gonna be the guest at a, like when we're sixty and we're still doing this. Yes. You're acting like this, you know, like those old wise men who just, you know, as a sign, as a sign of foolishness. All this gold. I'm huh? kidding. As a sign of wisdom. <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, it's been a minute. Um, the reason we couldn't upload is because I had left the country, and I had come back for school, and my friend was getting married, and we had to come settle things down here for Jay to come. And now I came back to Kenya, so we are back in Kenya. We're guys. back in Kenya. Yes. What part of Kenya is this? Kiambururu. Is that a part? Are you yes. making up a place? No. Guys, I've never heard of that place. I've never heard of that place. You should know places. No places, guys. Let's stop lying. We're back in the states. Um, and yeah, we're back here. If you guys wanna see the vlog of Jay coming, please go to the Wamagatas. Okay, go to our family channel, uh, the Wamagatas, and you can find the content there. Um, and yeah, let's get started. Anyway, guys, we know what you guys want to know. Ha! Huh, this love wow. stories. This love story. Okay, let's pick it up. We're not gonna argue. We've already figured out the logistics by now, so we're just gonna go straight to the point. Um, we were we texting. Haven't, we haven't figured we're not going back to the argument. No, out. we're not going back to that argument, babe. It's okay. a sealed deal. Okay. The big, the, the main point is that we were talking. Uh, it was every once in a while because I was still in school. Anyway, so guys, so I was done with school uh, on May 13th. And then I think I stayed a week in Washington. This is in 2021. I stayed a week in Washington. Um, by now we were not in communication. Well, it was still on Facebook Messenger. Like, guys, if you're old enough to remember Facebook Messenger. Anyway, so it was back in those days. Um, what do we call? What do we call? Messenger, what do we call? People are still getting uh, husband and wife from Messenger. Uh, Stop with the tapping. You know, I'm like, I'm on Facebook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Messenger, you call? Young kids are not using it. I'm going to text up a messenger. What were they telling you? Telling you? <laughs> Business. It was a business text. Whatever. It was. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Stop. Mind your own business. Stop tapping. Okay. Yeah. Stop. Anyway, so guys, uh, I moved back to. Um, so a week later, I moved back here. I came here. Now I started to. I started to study for the NCLEX. So at this time, we were still. I don't think we talked at that time, or maybe we were. It was just like once, once here and there. And then on July, once, 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 twice, once, once, twice, 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 and there, uh, still on Messenger. Um, and then I took the NCLEX sometime in June. And then, some, and then I think after that, I was, I was at home and I was looking for a job and some, a job or something. And that's when we started talking. I, I don't know when I gave you my number though. You asked me for my number. Mm. Do you remember the date? When? June. 
June 7th. Okay, I guess on June 7th. Uh, we started, uh, he asked me for my number. I gave him my number and then that's when we started talking. And guys, like from that point, like this friendship took a, took a whole role. We were talking on so Facebook. We, to... we were talking on Facebook since January, Feb. Yeah. Then we started talking on WhatsApp June. Yeah. Mm. But when we started talking on June, we used to talk like every single day. Yeah. And not like talk, we just mm. used to text every single day. Yeah, and mind you, if you know me, <laughs> if you know me, I hate texting. Like even mm. people, my family members know, call Esther, don't text her. Like I'll see your text <laughs> and in my mind I replied, but I just, I just, my fingers don't do the thing. But I don't know, I guess there was something for me about him. Like it was just vibes. He was vibes and inshallah, he was a good time. And I'm talking to him every single time. Like I would always some, learn something new, whether it was a Sheng word, I would learn. Um, whether it was, and he was just interesting. He was just interesting people, and he was mm, he was funny. funny. You, I'm very you, funny. You, yeah. Where are you going? I'm very funny. Okay, you are funny. Now yeah. I'm used to your jokes. <laughs> I'm kidding, but um, you know he was very funny. He was funny, and he was different. You know, it was different talking to you. Um, yeah. I think that's all I can say for me. Like, it was different talking to you. Well, vibes. Uh, you used to make me laugh. You used to make me laugh a lot. And you were not complicated. I like that you were not complicated. So, that's what it was for me. But, so, I guess I just used, we just used to text every single day. I mean, it was like a vibe too. It was like a bambi, it was like a kabeshti. Kabeshti, it was yolo, maju. Yeah, I mean, I was, just, I was just happy that I have a friend from the U.S. You're so funny. Mm. Every time you say that. No, but like, did you enjoy talking to me? And were yeah. you texting other ladies before? Like, the, on a daily? On a daily? No. Okay. <laughs> yeah, me and I was like, I, like, I was... You were too excited to be like... Okay, but what, what made you excited to talk to me? Like, what was different about talking to me? I was like... Especially kwa vitu za Kenya. Unajua me, I wasn't interested kujua vitu za, za US. Lakini, ya likuwa antaka sana kujua yeah. vitu za home. Kwa sababu ukondo, ukondo kwa. No. So unapata, we ulikuwa nyuma sana. Ulikuwa nyuma sana, like. As a Kenyan, <laughs> as a Kenyan, nilikuwa na vitu mob sana za kukukuna. Yeah, you had to catch so me I felt, up. I felt like a teacher. <laughs> so kila, yeah, siku, so kila siku lazima ungeingia lesson. Yeah. Yeah, but then he like used to teach me Shang words, and I really enjoyed Shang. Like Shang at that point was like it was nice, so I was like, oh, like I really want, want to learn. And then we had started coming to Kenya, so I was like, ah, oh. because people were talking, it it would just float, just float. But then, anyway, then suddenly you go and text na 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 nini when you too like na 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 changanya Shang nini. Yeah. Yeah. So like, kwa kila text lazima unge ni visa ati nini nini ati nini ati yeah. nini kusema. Yeah. So and I feel like nilikuwa. you were using those big words on purpose because i don't even know like you know like even kiswahili na juanga ile ya kuongea like ile i like to get by but if you like get into the kamusi i'm like what the freak are you talking about that was jali yeah. oh guys i learned a new word in swahili tulumu it's like abusing <laughs> <laughs> anyway so we kept talking and i feel like the more we talked the more like as much as there was like the you know the fun part it, it was like also like us getting to know each other because at that point, it was like, you know, like, you can't talk about Shanghai Center, right? But, like, you know, there would just be normal conversation. I'd be like, oh, like, how do you feel about this? How do you feel about this? How do you feel about this? Mm. And, like, in that in that setting, like, we really, I really got to know him. Uh, I realized um, he was very principled. He was very, very principled. Uh, he was like, if this is a no for me, it's a no for me. And he'd be like, and he'd be like, yeah, that's a no for me. And, you know, I like that it's, like, principled people. Like, nobody manipulates your stand. You have your own stand, like, and you don't let my stand influence your stand, you know, unless, like, it's it's something that's logically logically proven, you know. You don't, <laughs> you don't let it change your mind. So that was one of the principles, that, that was one of the values that I saw in him. Uh, and I remember just, like, at some point, you know, we were just talking, and I realized, like, you would, like, the way you... 
the way we viewed uh, the way you viewed marriage the way you viewed relationships hey at that point Mimi I was not interested in in relationships I was not interested in I was like me too mm-hmm. me too to you, you were interested to to not in me you you are interested in the idea of marriage and in the idea of settling down you are me I was just like nah baby I am cuz you know like what ha- happened is that like in 2020 2020 20 is it 2020 2020 that's when i felt the pressure to get married 2020 i really felt the pressure to get married me too no you didn't singles are kind okay in 2020 i had really felt the pressure and it's because like one of my age mates got married but she was even older than me so i was like holy crap i'm finishing school in 2021 like sina ka boyfriend mahali and it's like oh my tw- oh my covid um covid your summer complication uh they were just uh, no i don't see anything here so 2020 the end of 2020 i really felt pressured and it's because that girl got married uh and it was a very beautiful wedding so i felt i felt pressured by the way but now 2021 uh, i was just like this is not i was like i'm not gonna pressure myself i have money i'm a young babe i'm gonna travel i'm gonna enjoy my i'm going to enjoy my world and that was where I was that, that was my stand at that point because I didn't really realize like pressure was not doing it for me like the more pressure I, f- I felt like the more because 2020 was my year of pressure eh? like the pressure was increasing and increasing and I was just making the pressure was increasing yeah the pressure was increasing and increasing but and the more the pressure would do that I the more I would I feel like the more I would jump from from one complication to another to another as it just pressure, felt like as the pressure increased you decreased i was decreasing and making like terrible choices and you know being with and, you know trying to work out and crossing and trying to work out really like like situationships that really should i shouldn't have i had no business i had no business being there like so that's why i was like you know what just you just need to chill like i need pressure it on you this crossing of pressure is going to kill me eventually so I was like nah cut that out so 2021 i was like nah that's not that's not going to be me again because a apana and then you know now so i was like uh-uh, no nope, can't do that so now we come into so we just talked the whole of that year when did your feelings start to change feelings mm. when did you start to have feelings for me you're like hmm, she's cute well of course you knew i was cute from mm, day one she's cute you knew i was cute from day one let's not that's not september september is when you started mm. to Mm. But ni kidogo tu si ati ilikuwa sana. Don't do that. Yeah, Jay quite... likes to underplay it. Let me tell you. I remember this is how I was like what is wrong with this man? So, I went to visit my friend. I went for a wedding and I went to visit Sly as well. So, when I went to visit there, oh, mind you, we've been talking consistently since since June. When I went to visit her and Nat, Nat was back because I remember Nat had traveled to Kenya sometime and then she came back to the country and then she came back so when i went to visit nat and sly were, were both in the were both in the states so when you nilienda kutembea i remember i decided cuz now for me if you know like personally i'm not the kind of person to text you or text anybody every single day ever and because me I was just like me i didn't want complication or people going to be like oh like we're together and we're not no 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 because i didn't want all that what i used to do is that if we are if we're cool and i know like a guy likes me and i know i don't like them or i don't nothing's going to happen i would never let them text me like i would never be the person to keep up a conversation on text like i'll be like oh like i skipped today maybe i i i pick pick it up tomorrow so no no at least no you interest them get it this girl texts me every single day she's misleading me no 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 we're not going to have that so it used to be like so you used to find even like most people like what they would do is actually would call would call instead of texting me because me they knew I was not going to be consistent in texting but now here's this guy and we're texting every single day and nothing is happening so me at that point I was like i this is weird. so what and what caught me is that i think i was going somewhere i was going on a date somewhere and i realized the person that i was going on a date with if they found out that i had such a close friend that i was talking to every single day or if i found out they had the kind of relate or friendship that i had with him it would make me uncomfortable that's what i realized like we were talking every single day and nothing is happening but it's like why 
like why why are you talking every single day to a guy or like the opposite sex so I was like me and you're in a relationship and then like and then a guy finds out they have a close eye would have mm or if i found out my man had a friend like me uh uh-uh. uh got to go one of us got to go who's leaving <laughs> So I was like, that's when I started to be like, hey, this is a little bit weird. And then it was like so out of character for me. So I go to, I fly to Seattle and that day I decided to ignore him. I was like, no, I'm not talking to him today. So I think you texted me and then I ignored you. And then the next day you sent me a text that made me feel like crap. Do you remember that day? I don't remember the, the text. You don't remember the text, but do you remember the, the event I'm talking about? No. You don't? Anyway, so this man texted me. He was like he was like like he was like, "You know, Esther, like you don't have to talk to me. Like if you are mad at me, that's what he told me. He was like, "If you're mad at me, I'm paraphrasing obviously because I don't have I don't remember the exact words." He was like, "Like if you're mad at me or you don't want to talk to me, like I understand, but at least let me know like you're okay because I don't see you every single day. Um I don't see you every single day and you're not like a person that I can come and check up on because you're not close in distance." But like at least let me know you're okay and then just go on about your business. I feel like I felt so crappy. I felt so crappy and I was like, oh like so I lied to him. I was like, oh like I'm sorry, like you know, I've just been so busy catching up with my friends that you know, I kind of forgot. And then like in the days that I didn't talk to him, like in that day, by the way, it was like just like a whole day that I didn't talk to him. Like that day, I felt like I missed him. Which is a weird feeling for me. It's like it's hard for me to miss people. Like I'll I'll be like, yeah, I missed you, but girl, I did not miss you. But I actually missed talking to you. So that's when I was like, oh, this is getting weird. That's when I was like, this is getting weird. And then when I came back, so I, that made me feel really crappy. Though. So I was like, okay, you know what? In my mind, I was like, okay, this is harmless. So let's just keep going. And I, how did you know? Like, okay, I'm starting to catch feelings. August. Oh, August. When did you know? Mm. Like when exact? Like what made you realize? Oh. When you left. Shoot. When you realize that you realize that you are not going to be able to do But I wasn't asking you that because yeah, I was just. We were just. Yeah. yeah, we were just talking, guys. I was yeah, not trying we to be just, like, yo, do you got kids? Yeah, we were just. <laughs> yeah, we were just talking, and, and then you asked me about. The yeah. child, and then I told you no, and then you were like, eh, "You mean me to akona mtoto?" So ni kashindoa. You were me to akona mtoto, zina ingilia na hapi na mimi kuwa na mtoto. Oh yeah, I guess no, I can see that. So uli kona sama vitu zingine ni atawe bila kujua. Oh no. yeah. Yeah, so me ni lijua tu kita ambosano. But you know, for me it was like to my friends, mm-hmm. so I was like, "Oh." Tunajuanga, tuna tume umbo iki. Nah, me I was, but me by then like I was not in my feelings at this point. <laughs> I was not in my feelings. I was not in my feelings. But I will admit when I was in my feelings. Okay. I will admit. Okay, so for you it was August. Okay. Yendo ilikuwa siku ya kwanza. Nilianza kuonini. Kuona, kusikia, sikia, kuona, ona. Wait. Alafu, alafu. Wait. Alafu, 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 venya unaongea tu. Venya tu unaongea. Wait, we're not talking about me here. We're talking about you. How did you know? Oh, how did I know? Yeah, why are you talking for me? <laughs> me by the way, Nagas, I was not in my feelings. <laughs> <laughs> I was not in my feelings. Ah, pa, nah. No. I was ah, not in my feelings, by the way. Me, me, see, as you say, I'm not in my feelings. Na specific time, I think it's something that grew, like, it's something that like ili, ili, ili develop yeah and then when did you start to notice the pressure for you was creasing mm-hmm. the that's the question yeah October 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 yeah what made you realize that that's the question see you know see you know 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 you Feel what you're feeling. Yeah. yeah. Mm. And I remember like there's there was so many of us. I'm a kwangu mm-hmm. like ili grow kutoka stranger to kajuana like mm-hmm. to ka vibe to ka vibe to ka vibe to ka vibe yeah. to ka vibe to so, like a kuja like kika. Yeah. Oh, and I I think I think like something else that made me realize I this boy is in his feelings. This man mm. is in his feelings. I think there was a day Kenya kulipotea steam. I think worldwide. 
and you texted me on freaking messenger again and you're like oh like you're the only person i'm texting so, no. yeah it is you remember <laughs> and then you sent me like you sent me like a really long i think it was like around september i don't remember the months guys but it was like around september and you're like you sent me this really you're like okay oh because they knew uh, i never yo, used yo to yo take yo ni time. Yeah. Yo, yo ni time. Uko, uko, uko bored, uko lonely and oh so you were stuff. texting me out of loneliness si, si hey, una, okay. una, una kachini, una, 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 enyewe, ispokuwa, ni uyu mtu like ningekuwa singekuwa oh, <laughs> <laughs> so nilikuwa tu nakupea maua zako. Oh, you're cute. Oh, no. Yeah. He made he told me like I was Yeah. Cuz mimi nilikuwa ule msewa yeah. kama si kama si job niko niko yeah. kwa hao. Yeah. Kama si job niko. Yeah. Kama si job niko kwa hao. So yeah. unaona nilikuwa ule msewa sijui anaitwa introvert ama anaitwa. Yeah. Unaona. So nikiwa kwa hao every time if I'm not if kama si ku watch kama si kusikiza music yeah. like niko. Yeah. Yeah. So, like in that message you're like oh like he was so sweet like he told me like um acha acha okay but he made me he made me realize like oh like you're you're my friend but you're also like special to me like that was funona, you you, you were like you are you are talking to me yeah said you na for see you know no but i enjoyed talking to you mm, yeah. yeah so pia no na pia mi ulipo na tengeneza yeah yeah ilikuwa win win yeah so i think our uh, karma so I told I let him know that I was going to Kenya. I let him know that I was going to Kenya. But by now also by now like you know like when you notice like somebody's language is somebody's language is changing and I I realized that he, he had feelings and then I realized now the question was do I have feelings? That was the question. Only one has. No, but for me I think I didn't realize barely. Ah, only the way we like ajaba, only the ajaba bro. <laughs> Nini si 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 na kwambia na kwambia na kwambia Okay yeah maybe my lingo changed Yeah your but, lingo changed but, but when did me I didn't realize you it You didn't realize it That's what I'm saying yeah, you did That's it what even I'm saying without realizing And because for me okay. it was naturally happening and mind you guys this is a person who's never invested in any sort of relationship okay so <laughs> me I was like what kind of witchcraft is this Me kana na mani kumani pela ka kwa kama because I was like everything that was happening was so out of character for me and i remember just like um to look on on the man yeah i was like come and but i was like come and kalia chapo bro yeah because i was like you know like everything that was happening like i had i had i think for the first time for the first time in my life i was really enjoying talking to no getting to know a person being with like there was nothing about you that i disliked basically and there was nothing about you that was like oh this is a red flag you know and there was nothing about you that i even the things that i was like oh this is so annoying but it was like oh like this is what makes you stand out to me and and i think but now sasa i think that yeah my dad my dad was like esta no manya no manya me akano eradi so ne wagi ro nduka nduka corona itha ko nduka corona itha ko muno you know no ngi nyoga ikaragwa yes ikaikagia maitho you know that's what my dad said something along the lines of that and he wasn't pressuring me and i remember i don't know like towards everything that had been building up towards this point i remember just sitting one day and thinking like you will make a great husband that's what i thought like because of your personality nini 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 there were so many things that i thought like wow like this person would actually make a great husband and Kakuna kitu me I was like mimi stuck it warm to see my sister I was like guy mungu I cannot so I remember I remember like we were talking with Grace and Wendy she was like oh like baby he's he has actually kind of handsome guys guys when na kuanga na kuanga I'm cute ukiniona physically lakini kwa simu unaweza ona ka kwa simu unaweza ona ka busy ukikuja uniona na kuanga sana so na una sana ndio kuja kuona hapana like tukipatana ta au unione Yeah. 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 Anyway, so I was like, I don't want to be with somebody ugly. So I was like, okay. She was like, I think you mentioned like, one day for some weird reason. My sister was like, oh, yeah, you know by then this guy is kind of cute. And by 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 now my sister knew that I liked him because like I all, I would always play his songs in my like you know when we I when I was I guess by driving. But they for me, mm-hmm. I never sat down one day and like started thinking of what a hot kind of a wife you could make kwa sababu siko anaona kama inaweza happen so like 
singekaa chini nifikirie vitu zingine unaona mimi nilikuwa tu nilikuwa tu na vibe tu yani mimi nilikuwa tu dunia yangu no? But you know even when I was thinking that I wasn't thinking you'd make a great husband for me by the way. Like uh, I was thinking no by the way like for me it was like on a very like general general Like mina sema mi hata hiyo ya general thinking oh. like si kwa ikachi ni ni jaribu kufikiria what kind of our wife we make. And you know like I think for women it's different because for women it's all, it's always like because you're the one with the final say you're always evaluating. Like and that's how you find out like by you know you can have a these people that are like oh he's just my friend girl is he just your friend? Because like bestie mm, that it bestie but, bestie you know it's because like for women we are analyzers i feel like personally i'm an analyzer like oh like oh like you might not be great for me but like i know you'd make a good husband like your your character when you analyze your character i analyze do you, you don't huh. think so you like me analyze game ya leo mtapikwa na liverpool do you have to be so negative okay okay so that was that uh come okay so around november November I remember I was planning to go to Kenya in December. So at this point now at this point bando there were so many I still had so many complications going on guys. So many so I I started to be serious. By the way like I started to be serious and told God like God you know like I don't need all these people in my life. I just need God to help me find the right person. Like make make the right choice, find the right person. Hey let me tell you. Kaya mama mbi kama hiyo God will just do it for you. I your mom be Mungu anajibu bila bila nini acha nikwambie yuko mungu bingu that november hey nilipigwa nili that's when i was like eh by the way so that november i became very sick i had covid and it was like the worst covid i had ever seen. i was like i can't like i was almost dying and i remember that's when i i knew who like who would that kind of separated everything for me I realized though like this person is for me this person is for me this person is for me this person these people are not for me um it was a very big it was a very big event that we're not going to talk about today uh so I go to Kenya in December and before I left I think you, you told me we should meet up before I came to Kenya you told me we should meet up when you like unataka to meet I did and yo kula chipo ndio ni kupeleka kula chipo mwiti no, no. mtura so this man always used to like name this street food that i've never ate and i'm like where do you get these things so i was like oh like i really want to try this he's like oh i'll tr- take you to try them so when i was coming to kenya i was like oh uh uh okay yeah i wanted to kind of meet kuna sikutulishi na tukizunguka uliniambia nikutafutia mtura tukazunguka and he didn't even find some I But so I I went to Kenya in December and we the first Sunday that I came we linked up. We linked up that Sunday. Guys, I was so scared to go on. So, at first I was really excited to meet you. But then I was like, what if you are a killer? Plot twist. Ningekuwa tu. Don't say that. Ningekuwa killer si ninge kukill. I don't like that. Me too. You're making me suspicious. Yeah, yeah. ni junior je hivi nilivyo ni kwa nema yako nilipofika ni kwa huruma zako zimenifikia fadhili zako umenishangaza ewe awe aye Giving wifey, yeah. It's giving somebody that I need right now, so come and give me love.